Good evening, everyone. Welcome, indeed, to the Scottish Parliament. Um, a particular thanks to all of you for making it out on another snowy day. We had a, a number of call-offs uh, earlier, so I'm very pleased to see how many people have, have managed to make it along and brave the, uh, the, the weather out there. Particularly pleased that all our guests made it this evening, so a particular thank you to you, and I'll introduce our, our panel in, in a few moments. Uh, but first of all, uh, I should just say a few words about the Scottish Futures Forum and the 2030 programme in particular. The Scottish Futures Forum, who have the pleasure to host this event, uh, and the board of which I chair, um, is our, the Scottish Parliament's own think tank. And it's another opportunity, a very uh, uh, warmly received opportunity for MSPs and others to engage with yourselves and with the wider Scottish community uh, on the ideas that are shaping uh, this country of ours. And in particular, to try and do so beyond the immediate um, electoral cycle and the party politics that that tends to bring with it. So we're looking uh, to have a discussion uh, about the ideas that, and the policies that can shape our future. And in particular, over this session, the 2030 programme is designed to talk about what Scotland will be like in the year 2030. Now, we're going to look at all areas, um, culture, economy, politics, and so on. Um, but this particular year, 2018, we've decided to look at um, uh, our, the, the area of our lives, really. So we're starting with childhood and our upbringing. We're going to move on to our working life. And then we're going to talk about old age and dying in the year 2030, with the question being, how, how do we want to view and uh, approach these aspects of our lives in the year 2030? 